Good morning, Richard Eckley here again. Happy Monday. I got my coffee this morning on the way to work again, running a bit late today. Um, my thought today is on, on another part of your dietary needs. You've got your exercise and your diet is an important part of your, your health regime. And diet can be so important. We all sort of have like different jobs and different things we go through. And there's like three different areas of, of, of work where you actually burn your calories. You have like your office job, which is obviously a minimal amount of walking around and minimum calorie, bur but calorie burning job you then sort of like have your sort of your tradesman who's walking around quite a bit in the day and he burns more calories and then you have like your fitness instructor or outside worker and they actually burn more calories again so your calorie intake and calorie burn can depend a lot on what sort of job you do as well and then in the evenings again if you're sort of doing a bit of sport you'll be burning your calories but again if you're just sat watching tv for five hours eating some some sort of snacks and stuff you're not going to burn your calories up so it's important to get like a calorie balance as well to realize what your body t takes in and what you're going to burn up and then what you're going to actually need to, to actually adjust to help you to lose a bit of weight because I had a great uh, saying the other day was um it was uh, Zig Ziglar and he, and he said that um he's he's never accidentally eaten anything I mean if he chooses to eat too much today he's going to weigh too much tomorrow it's just the way it, it works so you have to reduce what you're putting in to reduce your weight I mean that's just the way it is and as, as simple ways again it's just just reducing the little things and just say once a week try and have some fruit and veg we all know we need, need to have more fruit and veg but you sort of say well why do we need more fruit and veg well it's because fruit and veg gets the energy from the sun transforms it into into energy and then we eat fruit and veg and we get the energy that's how that's just how it works and if, we, if you don't eat any fruit and veg we're not going to get the, the good energy we're sort of eating a lot of, sort of other foods that don't provide us much energy so if we can eat some fruit and veg a we're cutting down on the fat and b we're getting more energy so it's a, it's a double win so that's just a little thought. If you can get sort of get a bit more fruit and fruit and um, veg in your diet, as I said, I, I do like one soup a, uh, a week, a homemade soup. Cook up all my veg, job done. And one meal, at least one meal a week, I know I'm getting a good load of fruit and veg. Well, veg anyway, into my system, which is which is a basic basic thing you need every week. Every week, at least some veg getting in your system. That's my little thought for the day. Hope you're all having a good day. Uh, if you got value from this, always drop some coins below, and you can always get in touch with me at rickeckley67 at yahoo.co.uk. All the best.